Hi, I'm Dr. Agnivesh Tikku and I am a spine surgeon. Today we will be speaking about laminectomy and the reasons why you may need to undergo this procedure. Most of the cases, the laminectomy is done to treat what we call as stenosis in the spine. As we age, there is wear and tear happening in the spine and in other parts of body as well. In spine, there are nerves which are closely associated with the joints and they leave through the neuroforamen and especially inside the spinal canal. Because of wear and tear, there is encroachment on these nerves and they produce symptoms like back or buttock pain going down into the legs, which we commonly refer to as sciatica. They may also produce claudication, which means when the patient stands and walks, he gets numbness, tingling, cramping sensation in calf, legs and has to sit down after some time and he can then walk up again. This we refer to as neurogenic claudication. The laminectomy may be a surgery in itself to treat the degenerative pathologies. It may be combined with other procedures like fixation or fusion or it may be approach to a pathology which lies within the spine like tumors or infections. Nowadays, we routinely do not do extensive laminectomies like we used to do in olden times. We tend to do more minimal invasive surgeries wherein we do not remove the entire lamina but a small part of it primarily which is causing compression on the nerves and that is what is required. We can do this by minimal invasive techniques through tubes or through endoscopes as well which carries the advantage that the blood loss is less, the hospital stay is minimized and patient gets a quicker recovery. Thank you very much.